Welcome to KIDOAM.com. Kevin Miller at Hillcrest Elementary School. Mr. Deering with us, who so graciously had his class write letters from home uh, for the troops, which we'll be delivering starting tomorrow at Camp Shelby in Mississippi. Mr. Deering, thank you very much for what you've done. Tell us the experience your fifth graders have had here, and we, just, we want to make sure you stay in the shot here. Um, the experience your classroom has had, and some of the stuff that they've said in these in these brilliant letters here from home. What, what's been the experience like? Well, one of the reasons that we did this was that there are three of our kids who have parents who are serving in the military, and so I thought it was a, a very um, uh, closely related to our um, to our kids in the classroom that they know what their parents are doing. Um, we um, used it as a language assignment, <laughs> writing a friendly letter. Uh, we also used it as a, a government assignment. Um, but I had some of the kids who wrote some really powerful letters about uh, their own experiences of freedom. And, and uh, um, as, as the troops read them, I hope that they understand that we do appreciate what they're doing for us. So even fifth graders get it? Especially fifth graders. We study U.S. history. Oh. Uh, so we, we're very connected with the three branches of government. And, and um, I, we've had several military people in the classroom who are doing um, presentations for us. We have military people come in during Flag Day, during Veterans Day. Um, this is just one of those neat opportunities that our kids have had. Well, Mr. Deering, thank you, and again, for all you do teaching these kids, because they're the future. And what would you like to say right now to the people at KIDOAM.com, the troops, their family members, people around the world will be watching this? If you just look right in and, and give them your message. Well, I think that uh, from our classroom, from the fifth grade classroom at Hillcrest Elementary School, we'd like to say thank you to the troops that spend their lives, that, that uh, give their sacrifices, being away from their home and family, uh, so that our country can be protected. We appreciate our, our military. Thank you.